Hello, hello to the amazing people, the Nima here and welcome to another episode of Limbus Company, an amazing, amazing <laughs> turn-based uh, fighting gacha from Project Moon, where you collect uh, sinners, their IDs, and I'll take them into turn-based combats and uh, destroy your enemies, experience some nice story. You can find the full playlist in the comment description below the video. Uh, right now I'm working on the Refraction Railway Line 3, we just hit a... Uh, we just hit a resting spot here and we can continue our travels and uh, with my group nice and rested hopefully we can go and finish this railway this would be my first railway i actually finish if i do so the crow down and appear before us let me just uh those whose hearts were painted over their palette whiter than white what uh, what were their colors before something painted over them and turned them into empty canvases all right, let's enter this thing and uh, yeah, let's take my A team again. Uh, I guess I can grab this one. And this one might also be good, just to make the enemy a little bit less frightening, reduce its power. I don't know. Let's try with this first, see how it goes. Okay, so no. <laughs> All right. Oh, magic bullet might be decent here. Wave one out of three. Let's face it, we can handle this little ripple. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try without the magic bullet Otis here first, but that one might be really good for this. Well, this will take a couple of turns to even get to see what the boss is like. I'm really curious. Oh, come on, don't lose on me now. Okay, why is this thing keeps rolling heads? That's annoying. Oh, some free attacks, okay. It's gonna take us like two, three turns just to clear this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Refracted Palidified Tink Shield. Okay. Come on. You can do it! You can do it! Okay, one down. Yeah, I don't know, like... I will try to go for 100 turns, but I'm not gonna be too worried if I can't do it. Okay, I already said. Okay. It might be good to try to kill all of these now. It might be a little bit hard, though. Like... What are they weak to? Oh, Pierce. They're actually strong against Slash, so I don't have the best group. Hmm. Imagine if this will be just like... Like, just like a whole bunch of waves of these and no boss. That would be interesting. Surely it's not gonna happen though, right? How can this thing keep rolling heads? Over and over like that. That seems very unlikely. Okay. Oh, one left over. That's pretty bad. Okay. I think I'm gonna wanna repeat this fight, but I wanna at least see the boss before I start optimizing the the small waves. It might be wise to play this actually, to speed it up, that's probably optimal, like an AoE. This is not good usage of purple skill also, I mean it's strong but, refracted pallet blue mermaid. Okay go fast, go do some nice damage. I also have the AoE on Yi Sang. That I could use probably. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. That thing hits like seven targets. Illuminate Dive Acuity. And the These roll a lot. Jesus. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's do it like this. 
Gonna send this one here. Probably an overkill though. Uh, let's see, 70. 9 to 63. Okay. 21 to 34. Let's do another one of these. Okay. There. Something like that. I think they'll die in this turn though, even with all the resources I just sank, sank in, but that's fine. Well, maybe. We'll see. I think this one might survive actually. We'll see. Yeah, but with like two A's and a magic bullet. Yeah, I should bring magic bullet to this. That's why she's in the team after all, right? Well, that's nice. Okay, yeah, one was left alive. That's annoying, but okay. And finally... Oh. That's it? There's no boss, not really. Yeah, yeah, I'll definitely change my team for this. Interesting. We can save up some nice turns if our AoEs can clean them up. Now, of course, AoEs do use resources, which we don't have like unlimited amount, but... So there's like no boss. It's just these three. You can repeat the fights if you're not happy with how you did them, so that's... Something I fully intend to use. Okay, actually I have a lot of resources, so yeah, I can just continue spamming here. I don't know if this will like combine into a bigger enemy or something, so I will kill it before trying again to get a better time. Please don't taste me, bro. 30. Oh, another red. Oh, I just had one, didn't we? Okay, they're pretty strong against that. That didn't do, like, anything. <laughs> I rolled a zero or something. Yeah, that's because I'm spamming sanity, so Sinclair is probably positive sanity right now. Oh, no more ammo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll optimize this a little bit at least. Now I do want to save some time, but this fight is short. Ten turns. Total turns forty nine. Thirty nine. Okay. Um. Okay, so I take him, her, he ran out of bullets, but it's probably fine. These two are slash, so enemies are kind of resistant to that. What kind of skills do you have? Pierce. Oh, this one's Pierce, okay, there. Um, you. Blunt, you're blunt. Okay. Well, this one's not a damage dealer, not really. Slash, slash, yeah. I mean, DDDR is really good, though. Hmm. Let's bring her. She's just very powerful, either way. Alright. Let's see if we can do it in less than 10 turns. The Kurot, 75%. Okay, that's not good. 
But we can give him some sanity, so hopefully that helps. Struggling. Neutral. Okay, so this is how I'm gonna do. I'm gonna send this one here, and then this one to pick it off, and then this one here, and then this one to pick it off, and I'm gonna send this one all the way down there. Oh, you're too slow. Okay, then you can do this one, and you can do that one. Okay. Fine. Yeah, his ability is really good. Problem is that he has a huge chance to corrode, so... That's not that great. But she will give him some sanity now, so... Maybe that's... Uh, hopefully that chance is significantly reduced. Come on. This was favored. A word that the seeping rain may look through the umbrella. May leak through the umbrella. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. Oh, that's nice. That was not that good. Okay. Well, I can do a little bit better. Then 10 turns. Shame for that one though. One extra turn. How bad is it? I don't know. What's this? Like how many magic bullets does she have right now? Zero. Okay, well, that's the first magic bullet. That's not that great. I was got a little bit unlucky with her. Dominating favorite, favorite, yeah, whatever, let's go. Yeah, I also don't want to retry it like a million times. Like, if like relatively easily I can shave off like two turns or so from the fight, I'll be happy to do it, but pushing for anything more than that, I don't wanna like, I wanna torture myself too much. Okay. But yeah, it's good that I remembered we could use this Sun Shower ability. I don't know, I might have other, like, uh, that actually didn't do as much as I hoped. And the reason why I didn't take Sinclair is because I'm spamming Fluid Zack, so that would negatively impact his damaging abilities in the next fight. That's actually really good. I can probably two turn this. Okay. Uh... 22 to 73. Okay. 18 to 42. 33 to 67. Let me see something. This 10 to 32. 16 to 49. I can probably do this, yeah. 
16 to 49. And then these two, 18 to 42, 21 to 45, 28 to 66, okay, 15 to 39, 33 to 91, okay, 11 to 26, 15 to 71, okay. 22 to 47. Twenty two to sixty six. That's kind of not enough. Okay, I have very little that left, so maybe that's not the best idea. I mean... Some of these attacks sometimes do like... Whatever, just go. Ah, barely not. He can also do like AoE with his basic attacks though. Yeah. That's six turns. I guess with eight I would be happy. Not sure if I can do eight though. Let's see. So we need to kill these within two turns. I mean, collectively, they might not have as much HP though, because there's only three of them. This should be doable in two turns. I did use up a lot of like... AoE potential. The magic Otis thing definitely didn't pop off as much as I hoped. Yeah, maybe Otis was a mistake, I don't know. She's like on paper really good against... Okay, two left. Okay. So. 18 to 42. This is 34 minimum, that might not be enough. Okay, that might be enough, okay. Yeah, Otis is not doing... Okay, that was better, but... Okay. This one's dead. Now let's see if we can kill this one. Okay, we can definitely after that. Okay, good. Okay, eight turns. And a lot of resources used. Yeah. Depends what he's here, I guess. Station 10, brainwash. If there are those whose hearts are painted, then there is one who paints hearts. When the tray comes to a stop, I can see from a distance a confident figure. She's flanked by her followers. She stands as though to greet us, to paint over our hearts as well. Then we will meet her with, uh, with our weapons drawn. I don't know what's awaiting for me, but something like this yeah, is probably a good yeah. idea again. Unless we get run into some more ads, in which case, of course. <laughs> uh, these are stronger. Okay, I might not finish this fight, but I want to see what it is like. Again. Oh, it says only two waves this time. So there might be a boss. Oh look, it is the pellet wave background. Do we fight a Captain Ahab here? Yep, 
Yeah, the refracted ghost Pico Town villagers. Oh, come on. Ets. Ets, you failed us, Ets. We got critted. Okay. So first it attacks... Oh, Sinclair, Sinclair. Struggling. Whatever, just go for it. Just go for it. And see what happens. Yeah, this one it says struggling, so yeah, it's okay. I didn't want to like spend too much time here. This is just a test fight. Well, I guess both of these are test fights. So the hardest fights are still coming. Like zero six zero. Are you like, are you like trolling me? Like, okay, I don't want that. Let's see. Okay, you can go here if you're so hopeless. Okay, everything's hopeless. What are these? This is like... Why can't I win any clashes against them? Okay, this one's favorite. Dominating, okay. I mean, I can do something like this. Pew pew pew. Ah, uh, rip space, such a good attack. Uh, it has a million coins. Down. In down deal. Just barely not gonna be able to do it in this turn because okay. Well, I guess we just do it something like this, 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 and then this, this. This. And hopefully that's enough. Maybe a little bit too much on this first one. Oh, maybe not. Oh. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, maybe it has like three burning on it or something like that. And actually dies. These are so tough. I'm super surprised this is not enough. Not even close. Oh my gosh. <laughs> One HP, okay. <laughs> Be that way. <laughs> That's okay. And then we got the second phase as well. Okay. We might need to go spam AoE on this group as well then. Because this is just too many turns. Oh, it's Captain Ahab with all of its friends. Oh, crap. Oh well, there's the fight. Does it make sense to take up Ahab down first, maybe? Hmm, I want him to go f Oh no, I don't wanna destroy his purple though. Ah, it's so bad that he's last. Yeah, I don't remember how exactly this fight should go, but let's go for Ahab first, see what happens. What happens is we're barely doing any damage for some reason. Yeah, I should, like, I'm gonna do it in the next video, we're gonna check out its passives, see why is it so resilient, maybe because both of his friends are alive or something like that. Yeah, this fight will take a while, but, like, I have time, I have many extra turns saved up. Oh, okay, that's not good. Okay, this is doing more damage than I thought it's gonna do. Yeah, we definitely need to clash with those. I can't let this happen. 
Let me see something. Passive. A turn star gain offense level on defense level by the number of surviving allies. Okay, so she definitely gets defense. If not at the minus 45 SP, heal 15 SP. Turn end. If panic, recover from panic. When this unit is staggered, they set all their allies SP to zero. Okay. Heal 10 SP for itself and other ally with least SP. Other quick back to activate assist defense. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's cool. Okay, so that was not trolling. Definitely harsher times are coming here. That's nice. I actually think that's really good. Okay, so yeah, I, I need to see, do I need to repeat the fight before this to get like a little bit better uh, resources, which are really lacking right now. So we can repeat this fight, try to get our resources at a better spot afterwards. Yeah, because here we have eight in, eight in blue. So, and after this fight, I have like only six. So maybe we can do better here, like decide which characters. Maybe we do bring Sinclair, so he starts with like lower sanity, so we get a better start here, maybe. I don't know, but anyway, this was interesting. Uh, let's go to the menu. I'm gonna do some stuff before finishing the video. So first of all, my progress on the event thing. I did some more mirror dungeons, so I got some more rewards. So I definitely want these boxes. There we go. And I definitely want these boxes. And then I'm gonna grab these. Right. And now for the rest, I don't care here. Okay. So basically, I like I'm happy enough with this event. I, I still have time to play tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. One day, nine hours. Do I have time to play the day after tomorrow as well? No, that's in 48 hours. That doesn't work. Yeah, just one more day. But that's fine. I'm happy with what I have there. Uh, the reason why I don't really need these, you will see now. So... There's like 400 threads here and 500 gold experiences. If I go to the... I have 4,400 threads, so I definitely don't need that. And like experiences, I guess, that's a lot of experiences that I could grab there, but I have 1.2k. Um, let's go to the dispenser and let's go to the season 3. Let's see, let's grab another character here. Like, I don't know, Twin Hook Pirates First Mate Gregor. Okay, we're gonna need 334. Uh, 324, Gregor. Okay. Okay, first let's open these. So 320. Um, let's do like 300, then, okay, no, 310, and this one, oh no, I miscalculated, I get two per each, okay, whoops, that was a costly mistake, that's fine, maybe we can buy something else for him. <laughs> okay, uh, whoops, city, whoops, whoops. Well, that's not something that happened before, but it's fine. Yeah, that was a huge mistake. Oh, yeah, that's me. Something, 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 something. Oh, that was nice. Oh, some nice, quite quality art here. A little bit, like, very close up, detailed. Oh, yeah, that's me. The first mate of the Twin Cook Pirates. What? What an autograph. Okay, then we're gonna go and... Uh, and uptie it. To see its story. You wanna work together? Hmm, well, sure, I think I'll do. Well then, let's make this work. Twin Hook Pirate, makes sense, like he 
his whole story is about his right hand being something weird and for the pirate it's a hook so that makes sense <laughs> oh man all side out of the sofa as a child rested on its cushion he lifted his legs and placed his leather boot wearing feet on the desk as soon as he sat down everyone around him began busily going through the contents of their pockets huh? oh that one looks good i'll try that sick today yes sir got a light everyone anyone here it is sir one of the nearest sailors quickly ran up to the child with a lighter the child motioned with his chin as though he'd grown accustomed to the role treatment and let his underling light his cigarette he breathed in a lungful of smoke ah this ain't so bad which port did you snag this from we found it from one of our guests if you wish sir we could ah don't worry about it don't want them to get a heart attack and bite it or anything the sig will get old soon anyway understood sir well anyways the child flicked the ashes on one of the pirate's hands who'd been standing there with open palms like a human ashtray he took a sweeping look at his crew throwing another hefty hit from the cigarette right time for morning assembly how are side jobs going let's hear some reports starting from you yeah you there to my left yes sir we of the mermaid perfume department have captured ourselves a new species of mermaids and as soon as the child gives his order, the crew begins listing the state of their respective departments. Sales figures from various products such as mermaid perfume, ice cream, etc. Different numbers and statistics went in one ear and out the other. Huh, well, okay. So it's all shit then, am I wrong? What's wrong? Can't you get your tongues? Come on, I'm not trying to blame anyone here. None of them is our main moneymaker anyway, so let's get our actual business. How are our guests doing? We currently have a total of six guests in our lodgings, including the one we snagged recently. And how many customers do we have looking to get our guests back? <laughs> They're kidnapping people, of course. We currently have two in inactive, inactive negotiations, sir. They say that one of them is pretty loaded and come from one of the nests. Oh, nice. Oh, and one other thing of note for one of our guests, sir. We managed to snag somebody from sent from some company, apparently a team leader of sorts. Maybe we can re really milk this one dry. Oh, this is from the story from the our Limbus company. Oh, a team leader, eh? Now that's a catch. Seemed a bit green for a team leader, but I don't believe that to be much of concern, first mate, sir. Ah, uh, yeah, you did good work. Sorry about all the trouble, guys. Having to listen to a lowly first mate in the captain's absence sucks, don't it? Not at all, sir. Nah, I understand. <sighs> Cook, that bastard used to be a lot more reliable when we sailed the high seas. But as soon as we've docked, poof, gone. Off to drown in that fairy wine or whatever. The child grumbles in a half-joking, half-serious manner, but none of the crew laughed nor moved. They stood stiff and still like new recruits. They were awfully rigged for pirates, but they had a good reason to be. And that was why this man of such casual, seemingly laid-back disposition was the first mate of the pirates. Look here now. Ah, oh, don't freak out now. Trash about a little too much and I just might slip and take your whole noggin clean off. And if something so unfortunate were to happen, well, don't me blame me, okay? Now looky here, my future guest. This here is called Pistol with a little paw. You can get a new hole to breathe out of. Why don't you say hello to my little friend? You know, taxes me, taxes make it one expensive friend to keep. Oh, don't you nod your little head too hard? I messed, I messed with the trigger mechanism, and now it's really a hair trigger. So I'd like you to answer with a blink. Now that, not that you've got much to say. From now on, you'll be our guest. You've got rich friends, rich family. Hmm. Yeah, just like that. Just blink. Chill with us here until your friends get here with the ransom, okay? Play nice and I won't kill ya. Ain't that nice? Not gonna blink, eyes to dry. Want some eye drops? Still got some fight in ya, is that it? No, no, not at all. There was pirate something. With, his, with him doing this to every new guest in front of the whole crew, how could they not be afraid? Maybe this captain hook knew this child's talents. Maybe that's why the child was left to take charge in the captain's absence. Captain Hook didn't seem to mind how annoyed the child was though. Probably didn't even care to find out. All right, well, that's a little bit gruesome. The scary, scary captain, twin hook pirate captain, first mate Gregor. It's a boy's character. 
Poison Bleed character. I don't like Poison Bleed. Maybe they're good though. I don't know. Okay. Oh, did somebody... No. It's... Okay. Let's see. What did we get? Now looky here. My future... Guest. There we go. Bam. And yeah, I guess I can I can include it here. Uh, let's see. I don't know which one's better. Okay, good. Uh, next thing. Oh yeah, let's go into the dispenser. Who's who's is this? Oh, this is Gregor's. Nice, one hundred and six. Okay, we can fix our mistake now. <laughs> that was lucky. <laughs> uh, that was lucky. <laughs> Okay, six more, eight more, I don't know. Okay, three more. Two more. There you go. There we go. Bam! Garden of Thorns. Can't say I've brought you a gift. Aha! Ah, look at him, looking like a pretty princess, that's so weird. Can't say I've brought you a gift. Aha, take this instead. Don't try, don't try to entangle these brambles. Okay. Oh, that's a Vav. Okay, is it any good? Um. Before attack, a 3 plus highest resonance attack by plus 1. Apply 1 corresponding seat of infinite damage up and 1 power up to allies. At 4 plus corresponding resonance, apply 1 additional damage up. Heal 1 ally with the lowest HP for 15% of the max HP. Okay. I don't know. Let's see the. Oh, it's expensive. Well, it should be. It is a WAV level. Okay, and well, that will be it for this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. I wish you all to have a wonderful day. Do some nice things. Be kind to each other. And let's make the world a better place together. Thank you all for watching and see you in the next episode of Limbus Company. The Neomers signing out. Bye-bye.